Hello and welcome back to Shin Megami Tensei Persona 3 Portable. Well, we are really closing in on D-Day, so we might as well just... Push it, shall we? Children all over the world will receive presents from a jolly old man in a red suit. Like I said, it's funny I'm doing this on Christmas Day. I'm doing this episode on Christmas Day. Like the previous episode, Christmas Day. Because by the time you'll see it, it'll be after Christmas Day. But one day they will realize that the jolly the jolly old man doesn't really exist. They will be they will be sad, but their sadness will lead them to maturity. And then they will leave their childish toys behind. I don't know about that. Christmas. What an interesting holiday. You know what, let me do this. I'm so glad that everybody now is just like, okay, y'all need to fucking chill. <laughs> Yukari's room at the dormitory. Hi, Dada. Ah, what is that? Ah, hi. No, ka, mezurashiku nai desu ka? Senpai ga kuru nante. Dou ka shimashita? Iya, toku ni nai ga jamaratta ka? あ、先輩もしかして寂しいとか。おいおい、からかってるのか。いや、ちょっと言ってみただけです。ならいい。どんなやつなんでしょうね。ゆくすって。やっぱサブ太郎さんいるんですかね。さあな。ちなみに私は
この命で引き換えてグループは残る意志はまた継がれていくだろう倒せない存在ってことらしいですけどねでも本当のところどうなのかなそれ死ななそうって言ったら私たちのとこのあの子だってそうじゃないですか確かに体にデスが宿っていた影響とはいえペルソナ能力も別格だいろいろ背負ってるのにいっつも明るいですよね私あの子がいたから今までやってこれたのかもこんな風に大事な友達ができるなんてこの戦いも案外いいものだったりだってそうだなでももしもなんとかなんなくてもみんなと一緒なら私はいいかな極論言うと結果が生きるか死ぬかは実は重要じゃないのかも要は満足してそこへ行けるかってことなんじゃないかな And shouldn't that be the most important thing? ユクスに立ち向かうって選択なら私きっと満足できると思うんです。なくした父さんのためにもか。確かにそれもきっかけだけど、そう決めた私自身のためって感じかな。そうか。先輩、前に私に一緒に来いって言いましたよね。忘れてないでしょうね。忘れるわけない。一緒に行こう。ゆかり。はい Perhaps the creature with the with white fur and bright red eyes. Exams will be, exam results will be posted today. Hey, the results are posted. So I had to go look at the, yeah. You decided to go look at the exam results. You scored the highest in your class. Everyone's looking at you with respect. You remembered something. Mitzi promised to give you a gift if you scored the highest. You talk to Mitzi when she's at school. Lunch time's almost over. Guys, let's begin. Toko Hame de Imitama. Today we'll finally talk about magic right here in Japan. Though、so、I'm sure you think you're familiar with it already, you're probably not. 
The view that magic is dubious and culture is becoming more common. But what is swept into the corners of society today was once central to Japan. It could even be said that magic was invented in Japan. After all, Imiko of Yama Taikoku was a shaman. She reported using magic called Kido to control the country. Sadly, we have no way of knowing what kind of sorcery that was. The same is true for Prince Shotoku, who established a centralized government. He proudest on the old so I mean, since he was also a shaman. You ever heard of Abe no Semi? And they talk about Omyoji? That's what they're talking about. Omyoji. He was a shaman. Thankfully, I remember all this from a movie called Omyoji. And um, he also appeared in Warriors Orochi 3 Ultimate. With origins like this, magic was naturally woven into the very fabric of Japan in the Heian period, for example. The Bureau Omyo of Omyo was established for Omyoji to expel evil spirits and give spiritual advice. You may be familiar with that from the legend of Abe no Seime. What did I just say? Abe no Seime. Even in the age of the samurai, magicians played their part. Many generals who studied divination and military tactics could be considered magicians. They'd be called strategists. See, Shingen Taki. Or Kenshin Utsuki. Are you all listening? Don't become bad right now. <laughs> To test you to see how closely you'll be paying attention. Get it wrong and you'll hear more taboo phrases. Toho kani imitama hotokaran ashina I asked it. What sorcery was Kimiko said to have used? Kido. Very good. Thank you, Kotodama, for that. The trend to tying magic to the people continued through the Edo period, but the new government formed during the Meiji Reformation stamped it out. Sushi Mikado Shinto, which had been revived during the Edo period, faded away. It doesn't really matter. It's one
Where the hell is she anyway? I see one could see it that way. There are less than ten days until New Year's Eve. But for some reason I'm not scared at all. Oh my god, I'm a little scared. But I'm still gonna fight. When I lose, I'm gonna give it my all. I have no choice but to go on. The answer was right in front of me the entire time. If I do not come back, then someone else will have to take over the car. Although I have every intention of returning. There is a human, one of them I think, wandering around Tartarus. Please carry out a search and rescue. Goodbye. It's chilly today. I have got on the alarm. Uh, don't I? It's only she left early, so I'll be teaching today in a place. I think today we'll learn about near-death experiences. Tell me about it, man! There's no real reason for it, they've just been on my mind. Now, a near-death experience is defined as something an individual experienced just before death is a true insight and to the afterlife will simply trick at the brain. Opinions vary, but it is true that near-death experiences have been a hotly debated topic for some time. There are a few surviving records of ancient near-death experiences. According to the writings of Plato, a resuscitated soldier experienced the afterlife as a spirit. Similar incident was reported in Japan by ethnologist Kunio Yanigata in the Tono Monogatari. Psychologist Carl Jung wrote that in his own near-death experience, he saw a vision of the Earth from afar. I show you. Heard your own stories from famous or infamous individuals. I review first-hand reports with me today and let me read you some of them. I felt my... I felt as if my soul was detached from my body. I met a friend who had already passed away. I saw my whole life flashing before my eyes. I saw the most brilliant light. I was bathed in light. I experienced complete and total happiness. This is called euphoria. These kinds of reports are typical. Some have attempted to make direct recordings of near-death experiences. Research of Kenneth Ring has tried to quantify near-death experiences with a weighted core in experience index. Modern effects have led to a new theory of near-death experiences which goes like so. And if an individual who's dying denies that fact, he eventually realizes that death is a reality that he must accept and becomes angry. I've seen that too many times. 
As a result, he'll try to do anything he can to extend his life firsthand. I've seen that shit firsthand. <clears throat> but the futility of this leads to depression. Again, I've seen this firsthand. My stepdad. In the end, he accepts his fate. Although we initially denied him, we accepted in the end. That's how. That's just how we humans are. Is everyone this thing? It's not every day. You know, like this. <laughs> how about a little test to prove you were listening? Get it wrong and memories of your life in school disappear. I asked him. What is the feeling of happiness in the near death experience called? Toki. I mean, euphoria. Alright, that is correct. We will have a happy school night. Some people say near death experience awakens one's uh, consciousness. Well, or not. It's true, there's obviously no fear of death in those who have been through one. I've been through it. With my surgery, I've actually felt that. Perhaps this is because near death experiences are surprisingly free of pain and suffering. But this is not the way I want to help you to see what else is the time you'll have here while we okay. This that's all for today, class does Finally time for lunch. That's here. And, uh, well, uh, what's wrong? It's, uh, it, it, uh, hey, if you're free, let's look at, let's go some ramen after go. On me this time. Okay. Cool. Cool. What a coincidence. That's what you're here. And I asked you if you're free after school. Oh, thank you. Well, I'd like you to come with me somewhere. Guys, if you're there, just let me know. Well, she's level one, so I gotta spend time for her. Okay, now they want they want to spend time with you. Quite an encounter thing, considering all you had to do. You were for your heart to work. The king card said. In, a, in addition, you obtained the skill card Mediara Han for your high marks. I'm joking, what coincidence on your own way home? You now, would you like to do something? Sure. Okay, then, let's go. It's rare that I have any. At walk. Interesting. So this is what it looks like inside. Surprising. She seems nervous. Your first time? Uh, technically yes, but I did pass by here once with Akiko. So I understand that you don't eat with utensils. Here. I must admit I'm not very familiar with fast food etiquette. <laughs> it's probable to sell these items at such a low price. I'd be interested to know the average cost per unit. She's even intrigued. Mitzi, we're just here for a goddamn burger, girl. Uh, I'm sorry, I was lost in thought again. I didn't ask you here just to eat. I wanted to express my personal things to you. We're all facing a trial and a true sense of temper made it this far because we've been blessed with each other. I admit I've been hard on you, but much more so than the others. It's why you know. I appreciate your contribution. She seems to depend on you. You feel you understand her better now. Rank up! My 
didn't realize it was so late. When I went for you, the taxi was passed so quickly. Fortunately, I have another engagement. This was fun. We should do it again tomorrow. I apologize for the inconvenience. See you later. Let's go. You remember that Ken said he liked omelets and rice? He'd be happy if you made some for him instead of going out. That's why, that's why Ken. You decided to make a dish of omelet and fried rice that Ken likes. Thanks to your time in the cooking club, it came out rather well. He begins eating vigorously. Look what! As Ken happily tears into the food, he gets ketchup all over his face. See how happy you made him makes up for the effort. You feel you've gotten even closer to Ken. Rank up! You know what they say, a way to a man's heart is through his stomach. Even if he is just a boy. <clears throat> Dish can finally relaxes. Finally falls silent though. Do, do you cook for other people like this too? Um, like for your boyfriend? Do, do you have one? Um, um, uh, well, I, I saw on TV that all high school girls have a boyfriend, so I, I was wondering if you have one too. If, if you did, 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 did have, have one, uh, I don't think I'd like that. What, what am I saying? Are you, are you offering yourself, Ken? Uh, a Ken like me should be buttoned into personal stuff like that. Uh, Ken. You know what? Just We're just gonna just come out and say it. Look. Ken. I don't have one. She doesn't have one. Is that so? I see. Oh, then is there anyone you do like? It's right in front of me. What? He looks around. I'm the only one here. Huh? Don't tease me just because you think I'm a kid! He gets angry and turns bright red. <laughs> um, if I... If I said that I liked you, would that bother you? I don't... I'm sorry, I should have asked you something so weird. Oh, go to your social media Um... Oh, she. Um. It's like, oh, if you. Are you offering yourself, Ken? Finally chatted with Ken until late in the evening. He's fine. He'll be. He'll be okay. <laughs> Today's the Emperor's birthday. There's no school. Two days. Prior to that, really was the Emperor's birthday. We didn't think about it. In the back alley of Tatsumi Port Island. I'm 
島田さん。いいのか、ここで。はい。お墓の前にしようかとも思いましたけどね。でも、今母さんに何を報告するのかって考えたら違うなと思って僕はまだやることが残ってますからああ俺も同じだ We're in crime alley, folks. 今真摯に告げに行くことは何もない俺にはまだやることが残ってるからな決して勝てない敵かどんな相手なんでしょうねさあなだが関係ない俺はもう目を背けないと決めたんだどんな相手だろうと変わらないまずはこの目で見てやるさまずは見てやれかそうですね一緒に行きますよ僕も I want a frog bear from Wuck. Let's go to Wuck. So the other day, Mom and Dad, they talked about me, about why, they talked to me about why they were getting divorced. I was sad, but I listened to what they, they said. Did they do good? Good girl. <laughs> Thanks a bunch. Mom um, and Dad, they said when there's no love, it's hard to still be married. That's true. They said not to worry because they will always love me. I tell them it's okay to get divorced. It must be hard to live together when they don't love each other after all. So, I have to choose where I want to live with Mom or Dad. Can't choose that. You decide for me, okay? No. No. You make that decision for yourself. I really don't know. At least a big sigh. Well, Mom might move somewhere far away if I, so if I went with her. I couldn't play with you anymore. That would be bad. You felt like you really were my big sister. It really seemed like it. Like ship strong. Eight. Rank up. Remember, working <laughs> working as one character but using my mindset. So I was like, well what do you think? What do you know? What do I think? What do you think? You you think about it. I'm putting the ball in your court. It's like, well, what do you, who do you think I should? No, I'm not going to answer that. It's like, no, you answer that for yourself. You decide. Who do you want to live with more? Do you want to live with your mom or do you want to live with your dad? I better get home. Can hey, you hold my hand on the way home? more days until New Year's Eve. Because so I haven't made up your mind yet, Shinsa. Well, I have. I'm going to fight. I thought about it. I realized that there wasn't really a choice to be made. I don't want to have to tell my mom and Shinjiro-san that we failed. And we aren't. 
Well... You know what, let's go to Theo. Two hundred and two oh six. So since we've taken out the bosses, well, we can actually look for them proper. So we are going to start around 190 and go from there. Now we can really take our time because um, we took out all the bosses. Wow, this is amazing. We have a we 
you have a clear view of this entire floor. Baron. So we just have to race up to um Garage Sandals. Cool. has learned Masakusha. Masakusha. Masakusha! Masukukaja. Yes, Masukukaja. The Shoes of Bane.
now back to eight. Like out of hand. do it in this part. Don't worry. How fast I'm actually this is how fast I just basically go like boom 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 just like this. I almost forgot. I'm like, oh yeah, let me get that.
You're probably wondering why I did that. I was like, well, think about it. How often do a kid, uh, honestly, you know, receive compliments? Oh, damn, that, that, that's a, oh, yeah, yeah, let's get the fuck on out of here. Floor, so I don't have to. I don't really have to cut. Go kids! We got Chun Ki Dai Dao. Chun Ki Dai Dao. These regal bitches. Thank <laughs> you. 
I counter as well. I love the fog of war. No longer is he in trouble. We got. It. around, huh? Let's go pick this one up. Uh, it's not the one. It's not one of the ones who went missing.
It's a good thing you were able to find the missing person. We're resting in a safe place now. Christmas Eve. Today is December 24th, Christmas Eve. It's an important day in Europe and America. Although, unlike in Japan, December 25th, Christmas Day is even more important. Do you all know why we celebrate Christmas in the first place? In Japan, Christmas Eve is just a day for couples to spend time together and give gifts. I feel tired. It's interesting that a day which is celebrated worldwide is observed differently from country to country. Another, another example is Valentine's Day. Try looking up online if you're interested. Yay. You received a text message. Hey, are you free today? I'm gonna ask Fuka too, but do you wanna have a girls only party? Texting you because Junpei would definitely jump in on an idea and make sure it's a secret from him. Sure. Victoria arrived. Yes, ah, it's finally over. Why don't we head over to Polonia Mall? The perfect time you flick it to too. You have come to Polonia Mall with. Yuka and food. Oh look, they even put lights all over the mall. It's beautiful. To see illumination. It is. It's great having people to appreciate it. Yuka and Fu seem to be enjoying the Christmas decorations. Let's enjoy the scenery here a little longer first. You walk around and enjoy the lights with Yuka and food. After that, you have a small party at Yuka's room. Happy, I mean, Christmas. <laughs> you see a cake with candles, you get that urge to sing that. I was going to try out this cake. Houston Noel is sold only around Christmas time. That's just one house chest, that's inside. Oh, that sounds delicious! Let's eat! Hold your horses, let me cut it first. It feels like such a shame to cut such a work of art. I know the feeling. So pretty, I just wanted to leave it on this one. Yes, exactly! See, you understand! Junpei would be like, Oh, I'll get you chicks. Maybe it's a girl thing. Yeah, right, let's eat. You're talking... You talked about different things as you ate the cake. Christmas almost over already? Actually, it's just begun. I'm still recording. <laughs> oh, my stomach hurts laughing so much. I don't think I've ever had this much fun on Christmas before. I've been spending most of my time with a boyfriend once I got in high school. Like Christmas, it just with the girls is pretty fun and gossip. Can't count me into it. I'm glad, I'm so glad I came to this school. Oh, you're exaggerating. No, to be clear, I feel the same way. Let's get late, so. Oh, is the party over? Nope, it's time for embarrassing stories. Christmas night passes.
Trina? Can you visit him so we can talk for a while? It looks like he's Thanks. She seems relieved. We're at walk. Hey, um, do you remember when those guys stole my wall and you came to help me? And just, uh, I just blared out the, the music. And I was just so angry at myself. Did you make you mad? No. Oh. Really? I'm glad to hear that. She seems relieved. I always just blurt out whenever I'm thinking to you. We're just friends. Hmm? I see. Oh, I get it now. That's how friends are. <laughs> you weren't expecting that, huh? Good. I think that's a part of me that's really unsentimental. I always keep thinking of myself as apart from others to tell the truth. I didn't care about other people. But at the same time, I didn't want anybody to get involved with me either. I don't like the actual Shima. That's kind of different with you. I don't mind how much you tried to be my friend. Actually, I look forward to it. I think deep down I wanted someone to understand what I was going through. Or maybe I wanted someone to be sympathetic to say, Oh, you poor thing, you're doing your best. I didn't want someone to try and take special care of me once. And then just let anyone do it. I only want someone I'd like to do that part of. She smiles. You sense, you sense her affection for you. <laughs> Yuka is borderline less. She she's going toward that borderline less route. Guys, I didn't mean to just start babbling at this embarrassing stuff at work of all places. Come on, your fries, we're leaving. Right, let's grab some Animitsu before going back. Get Animitsu at the sweet shop with Yuka before heading back to the door. Hey, did you know that today is December 25th? <gasps> you don't say! What a terrible Christmas. Yet, people actually make horror movies around Christmas. Sick fucks. Christmas will be better next year. That's right, next year, we're not gonna let the world in. There will be a Persona 4. <laughs> <laughs> the world will not end. We will have a Persona 4. I believe in it. It's going to be winter vacation too. I wonder what will finally sign. Whatever it is, I hope you won't regret it. There's only one week left. This will be both the longest and shortest week of our lives. So, Rusum. To the missing help wife left with us. You rescue her, right? No last question, just take it. Eight diamonds. New stuff. Ame no Nuboko. The Halbert used in the creation of the world. Hero's bow. 
bow made especially for a hero. We're gonna call that Zelda's bow. Kaladabog. It means hard lightning. Hard lightning? Okay, the Illuminati. Crusher Fist. Nuxel. Nux. Nuxels? Knuckles designed to deal heavy damage. Knuckles of exceptional power. The Kiss of Athena. Gun as potent as a goddess kiss. It will knock you straight the fuck out. Pish cats. Knife will cure the shit. Oh, we are got it. At least we're getting some good DOS from it. We're just getting rid of all this stuff real, real fast. That's you.
Today's the last day of second semester. You think about all that has happened. However, you must still go to school. Morning! It's cold today, but it's worth it for winter vacation tomorrow. And again with your New Year's gift. I've got our gift. I want to get a lucky bag. I'm in for that purse. Hey, you want to start waiting in line today? We can bring a Kotatsu. First, baby. Winter break starts tomorrow, though I'm sure most of you are just going to sleep in during New Year's. Just like I'm going to do with Christmas. Sleeping. But just not relying so much on your parents. And don't fall asleep in the Kotatsu, okay? Speaking of Kotatsu, I reminded of a passage from a famous novel, The Shutter of the East Window. Oh wait, that was a Kotatsu. Feels hard. Yeah, I'm going to do it. Because nobody cares. <laughs> Today marks the end of second term. Winter break begins tomorrow. So, usual. What kind of I want you cook today? I think I'll learn some things if I want you cook. Is that what you're going to make today? Well, you ever wash your utensils while you were cooking? It's like you have extra hands or something. Why don't you write that down too? Sheena Chan has lots of hands. What? She's taking all kinds of notes in her thick notebook. The pages are filled with small letters. Oh, well, it's kind of embarrassing, Sheena. <laughs> uh, I took notes on everything you did, all the steps you took to prepare the grades. I think I'm gonna start in analyzing things. So I, I thought that it might work if I attempted cooking from an angle that I'm good at. Up till now, all I did was try harder. But saying that I'll try hard each time is hard. I actually put it in thought to it. That's why I've stopped thinking of attacking everything with that mindset. And I've begun trying to find ways that I can do the things I'm not good at. When I began to think of that way, I felt much better and I started enjoying what I'm do what I was doing. I need to understand situations instead of just being overwhelmed by trying to do my best. So I hope that by taking notes I'll be more likely to succeed. I couldn't accept the bad parts of me this whole time. But you saw all the things that were bad about me while you were here cooking with me. You always encouraged me to when I missed it. That's why I thought I should also try to like myself for who I am. She smiles gently. You feel like you're growing even closer to football. Eight. Next time I'll make something. I'll do my best. I'll, I'll do what I can and try my best later. Kimika, go ahead. 
ticket time has finally ended you now. Only five more days left until New Year's Eve. My fear and anxiety still remain. I'm no longer confused. I'll fight until the end of you. I made up my mind. Time for story. Talk to me, Poor Island Station. ちょっと。ここ。ここ。ここ。ここ。ここ。ここ。ここ。ここ。ここ。ここ。ここ。ここ。ここ。ここ。ここ。ここ。ここ。ここ。ここ。ここ。ここ。ここ。ここ。ここ
今日は夜になったらラウンジに終盤ね忘れないでようんうんじゃあねユクレフトウィンターバケーションコンティニューズデイタイムゲスワイバーンモード You have something planned tonight. Will you sleep until then? Yes. Dorm lounge. Everyone gathered around Igis, who's finally returned. もう一周と言われたのだ無理を言って急いでもらった明日は大晦日だからだ<笑> <本当にご迷惑をかけてすみませんでした。笑> ラボの方へはミツルさんが来てくれていましたあの夜のことは聞いてますいろいろ大変だったみたいですねお元気でしたかえ元気なはずないですよねこんな状況じゃ Welcome back. Well, you know what? It don't matter at this rate, so guess what? Don't worry about it. My mindset. Shinasan, Ryoji Kun, I eat the cotton. Dasareta sent a no cotai. No, Kinetan deska. Yes, I have. On a guy, I must. When she says this, this leads to two endings. She feels partly responsible for everything. We're actually going to stop here. Because, um, what we're going to do, what we're going to do in the next part is basically, we're going to finish the LP. But どうしてここにいるんだろう。いくら皆さん思っても涙を流すことさえできないのに。アイニス。どうして無駄と分かってて戦おうとするんです。どうして一つしかない命を苦しいだけの戦いに使ってしまうの。そんな。
命を投げ出すようなこと私には全然わからない I don't plan to waste it. Ah, so that. So no key that I can. So key on it, I can. So that. Hi. I can't even say. You know, it's a lot of my life. You live, you learn. That's what it is. So no, you know, it's a lot of my life. She nods reassuringly. The resolution in Iga's heart has awakened a new persona. Henshin! Palodian has given rise to Asina! You already are. Never left, so therefore it's like, uh, can I be? So, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to stop for this session.
And in the next part should be the final part in which we're going to end this madness once and for all. Showing both sides. Or, or rather, we're going to deal with the final boss. Or we, or what we might do is, um, as far as what we're gonna do, we're just gonna deal with the, we're just gonna deal with our decision and go from there. You gotta scare me. I'm looking. I'm looking through. Okay, so next part. Let me take that back. It will not be the final part. It will be the penultimate. Okay. So in the next part. We shall take it from there, and um, we'll leave it at that. So stay tuned, more of Shin Megami Tensei Persona 3 Portable right after this. Thanks so much for watching.